Today's dental care is light years away from where it was just a few years ago. One of the incredible advances that can change lives of many, implant dentistry. Reporter Christopher Michaels spoke with Dr. Dan Zeppelin from suburban Denver, and he talked about all the developments that can improve your appearance, your confidence, and most importantly, bring comfort and functionality to your teeth. Comes your way in three, two, one. These days, with a lot of new advances in dental medicine in particular, we take a look at replacing a tooth. What's the best way to do that? You know, the best way to replace a tooth is really to look at dental implant options. Dental implant options can give us the closest natural replacement for a missing tooth compared to any of the other previously available options, such as bridges or removable partials. So what are some of the things that put it heads above that? First and foremost, it's like a natural tooth. It's not attached to any of your other teeth. With some of the previous options, you were dependent on anchoring on other teeth, whether they were healthy or not. But an implant is freestanding. You can brush it and floss it and chew with it just like a regular tooth. Can you do more than one tooth at a time? Absolutely. Uh, We can do dental implants for a patient who is missing just one tooth, or somebody could be missing two or three teeth, or even all the teeth in one part of their mouth. We can look at all those options with dental implants. This seems like something that might take a long time. There's a lot of different ways to do dental implants. For some of our patients, we can offer same-day implants when an implant goes in and a temporary restoration goes on top. And there are other situations that the patient's better off long-term looking at a delayed approach. At my office, we really work to look at what's going to give the patient the best long-term option. Whether it's same-day or delayed, we want it to last years to come. Now, this also being the kind of economy that we're in, a lot of people who are dentists are saying they can do implants, but maybe they shouldn't? Well, anybody can say they can do implants, but if I were a patient out there or was a member of my family, I'd really want them focusing on having their care done with a dentist who is experienced in implants, has credentials with an organization like the American Academy of Implant Dentistry, and didn't just learn to do their implants in a weekend course. I want somebody from my family and my friends and my patients who truly knows what they're doing and is an expert in the field. Dr. Dan Zeppelin, this is Christopher Michael reporting.